We're going out for our second bug hunt of the year. This time I've got Duncan. Hello. And Lilia and Kai. Two thirds of the family out for a bug hunt. Yesterday the typhoon went through, not sure what we're gonna find today. Might find a bunch of stuff, might find nothing. Hoping to find another Nokogiri because Kumiko gave the one we caught to her friend. Duncan said it was okay, right Duncan? Yeah. I mean, it's fine, giving away a Kugata, that's great. But it's so much more fun to go out and catch them yourself. I'm assuming this friend has children and wanted a Kugata, but could not go get one themselves for some reason. Cause they're busy? Cause they're busy, could be, could be. Now you can always find an hour to go look for Kugatas. Don't you think? Sure. I don't think I'm gonna take the camera with me into the woods because it's actually quite difficult to hold the camera, the flashlight, and look for bugs, you know, stag beetles, rhinoceros beetles, all at the same time. After I put the camera down, we'll go do our hunt, and then if there's something good, I'll show you that. If we're lucky, maybe we'll find some rhinoceros beetles today too. That would be cool. What do you want to find, Duncan? Kabadoshi and Kwagata! So both, okay. How about you, Lily? Anything particular? Rhinoceros beetle. Okay. Kai? So both, okay. I'd kind of like to find old Kuagata, one of those big suckers, because they're a lot harder to find, and I've never yet caught one. I want Kabutomashi and like a rainbow. Duncan, we said that last time. The rainbow Kuagata is in Australia. We will not catch one here. Why? Well, we need they, to buy one. They don't live in Japan. And we need to buy one if we want. Maybe we will. Maybe we'll buy a rainbow this year. Who knows? Yeah. A pair, of course. Not just one. There's no point in getting one. Except that they are, they're pretty. I got a rainbow before. Yeah, we had one before. A couple times, actually. I got one off of a Yahoo auction really cheap. And another one, I was given the uh, the larva. They didn't live very long as adults. And before I could get a box set up for them to breed, they died. It was unfortunate. I saw a rainbow Kogata before. Like, I, I thought they were fighting and tried to put them both away and it bite me one? The female, yes. Lilia thought they were fighting and uh, the, the female bit her, got angry. They weren't, they weren't fighting. I thought they were fighting. Yes, well, we haven't explained that bit daddy, daddy, daddy. They were hugging, daddy, daddy. yes. Daddy. I like rainbow. Cool. Like I said, I'm hoping to find something I haven't found before. Who knows if that'll happen or not. Now, I definitely gotta put down the camera because the windows are fogging up. I'm talking so much. We just had a pretty good hunt. Good! Good! Yeah. Good yeah. fun! You know, we had a good time of it. Uh, there was me with three of my kids out, my sister-in-law with her three kids, and my friend, his wife, and their two kids. So we had 12 people traipsing around in the bush trying to find bugs. It was fun. Keeping track of everyone was difficult. But we managed, didn't lose anybody. Except for my friend, he fell down a one meter embankment and ended up in the bush and lost his shoe, but I found it for him, so that was fun though. Well, I think we got a pretty good total. Uh, more than I thought we would, because at my friend's place, found nothing. Like, like The place we always go first is actually my friend's property, and they've got several of the right kind of trees there. Nothing. Last time, two weeks ago, that was where we found most of the stuff, was at his place. So we all went over to the bush. We found three Nokogiri Kugatas. I guess I would translate it as saw a stag beetle. We found four, right rhinoceros beetles. Two males, two females. Actually, no, we found five. We kept four, and we found three nokogiris. We kept two. Yeah. My friend's kid, he just wanted one male kabutomushi, and the other kid wanted one nokogiri, so we got most of them. You can see one of the rhinoceros beetles there. Oh, there, that's a male. There's three more in there somewhere. There's two. One male, one female. Are two male, alive? two female. There we go. Oh, they're all alive. They're doing good. That's a nokogiri, good size one. And in Duncan's box, where's your box? I can't. Let go. Oh, you're, you're belted in? I can't, you can't let go of your box? Okay, well there is a nokogiri in there too, a smaller one. So of course when we get home, I'll pull them out and take a slightly better video of it. Now, we drive. Well, I drive. You guys just sit there, okay? Yeah, I can play. Me too, me too. Okay. I can play. I can play. I can play. You know, you're all crazy. Of course they are. Crazy. Of course, of course you are. You're my kid. I am crazy. I am crazy. Daddy's crazy. You know it. So I wasn't able to actually take video last night when we got home because things were really busy, getting the kids to bed and whatnot, and editing Sweet Tooth Thursday. Ow, bugger! He got me. <laughs> oh jeez! Through the kit bars of the uh, of the bug collection box, the Nokogiri Kugata just got me. Nokogiris are very aggressive. There is the small male we found last night. Here is the large male we got last night. When they get bigger, they get that swoop to their what do you call them? Antlers, pinchers. The smaller ones are much straighter. There's a bit of a swoop to them, but they're not as impressive as this guy. If you guys fight, you'll lose. 
stay away from him. For now, I'm gonna put them together in the one box and hope they don't fight too much. The others, which we were really happy to get last night, were the Kabutos, rhinoceros beetles. Two males, one with a fairly big horn, and the other under his butt, with a much smaller, not as impressive horn. Oh, and they're fighting. Don't fight, don't fight, whoa! And they grab on, they really grab on. He is not gonna let go. The bigger male, the smaller male. Wow, he is really holding on. Get in the box. There's food in there. Gotta be careful with those guys sometimes. I have had, not one of the Japanese rhinoceros beetles, but an, an atlas beetle actually cut me with its feet. They were so sharp. There's one of the females, no horn. And there's our other female, no horn. Unfortunately, I, I do not have enough mat in their box. I have to go buy more. But what there is, they're already digging into. Probably because it's daytime and they want to be asleep. They want to be in the ground asleep right now. Here you go, you go, whoops, she jumped. She's good. So I would say our second bug hunt was much more successful than our first one. I think next time I want to try a light trap. That'll, that'll be fun. I've never done that before. Let's see how that goes.